The tears continue to flow in Valencia. While some towns have been reached by the military and emergency services, others are still desperate for help. This school in La Torre has become a medical center and a drop-off and distribution point for the basic needs. You can see people queuing here from the worst hit areas to get food, water, milk and hygiene supplies. And the Mestalla Stadium, home to Valencia Football Club, has also opened its doors, with food and water arriving from all over the country, ready to be distributed. The response of the people has been absolutely amazing. Uh, this is just one of the points where people can bring uh, all kinds of supplies, uh, food, uh, detergent, uh, blankets, whatever. This is just one point in the city. There are points of uh, reception of this stuff uh, all over the city, all over the region. Uh, and uh, they are flooding uh, from everywhere in the country. While authorities continue the search for bodies in underground car parks, an army of volunteers has come to help in the worst hit areas. If we don't come, no one will help. People need us here. Yesterday, I saw Valencia's bridges full of volunteers. It gave me goosebumps. Here the people come to help because the government don't do the things well. The volunteers and the outpouring of help and generosity, a ray of light in a dark moment for Spain. Ken Brown, CGTN, Valencia.